Title, White Sox skipper Griffel hits showers early, a toss-out drama amid Dodger duel. TL, DR, an on-field fireworks display ignited last night as the White Sox's skipper, Pedro Griffel, was dramatically ejected in the sixth inning during a high-stakes showdown against the Dodgers. Griffel, the fiery leader of the White Sox, was seen arguing intensely with home plate umpire Pat Hoberg following a contentious tying run. Hoberg's response? A one-way ticket to the locker room for Griffol. Once upon a Wednesday night, under the star-studded Los Angeles sky, Pedro Griffol, the first-year White Sox commander, strolled out of his dugout with a stern expression. The Dodgers had just cooked up a savory tying run, and Griffol's blood pressure was clearly rising like yeast in bread dough. Question for you, dear reader, are we watching baseball or a Hollywood drama unfold? As tensions reached their peak, the crowd bore witness to a legendary duel, not between the players, but between Griffol and the umpire. In a startling display of raw emotion, Griffol, gesticulating passionately, was seen in intense confrontation with home plate umpire Pat Hoberg. His cardinal sin? An apparent disagreement about the Dodgers' tying run, with Griffol pointing fervently to his right. Did you think Hoberg would let this slide? Well, hold on to your hot dogs, folks. Hoberg, without skipping a beat, showed Griffol the quickest way to the showers. In one swift motion, he tossed our beleaguered White Sox leader out of the game. If you were there, the deafening hush of the crowd followed by the chorus of both shock and awe would have made you wonder, is this the baseball version of an opera's climax? We've got passion, drama, and an audience on the edge of their seats. Who needs Broadway when we've got Major League Baseball? But let's not forget, this is Griffol's first year in the driver's seat for the Sox. The stakes are high and every game counts. Could this ejection be a strategic attempt to fire up his team, or was it simply an eruption of frustration? Perhaps it's a bit of both, a delicate dance between maintaining authority and pushing the boundaries for the sake of the game. After all, isn't it this fiery spirit, the willingness to stand up, to be heard, that makes sports as thrilling as they are? So here's to Pedro Grafol, you may have been tossed, but you certainly weren't forgotten. But now, the real question, will this incident make Grafol more cautious or more audacious as he continues his rookie year at the helm of the Sox? What's your take, dear readers? And just how much popcorn should we stock up on for the upcoming games? Disclaimer, this story is a summary of events reported by a third party. It does not provide recommendations or opinions about the actions of the individuals involved.